It's not too late, I hope. Oh, no, no, of course not. I... Come on in. Okay. I, I, I wanted to return these. <laughs> You're kidding me, right? No. No, I, I, was, I was going through my uh, CD collection, trying to weed out some of the more embarrassing reminders of my callow youth. I, I came across your Counting Crows collection. Dawson, you borrowed those, like, three years ago. Yeah, I know. I uh, apologize for my appalling lack of etiquette. No. Uh, no. I, uh... So I should go. Why? Because it's none of my business. What is it? Pacey. Okay, you're gonna have to start making some sense here, Dawson. You know, just... Just talk to Pacey, okay? About? About school. He's in trouble. What are you talking about? Well, he didn't show up for school today, and if he's not careful, he's gonna flunk out. And I can't for the life of me figure out why I should even care about this, but I'm here, and if there's anyone who can help him out, it's you, so. <laughs> oh, no offense, Dawson, but if Pacey was in such dire straits, don't you think I would know about it? No, I don't. Why? Don't you get it, Joe? When you love someone, you want her to be proud of you. You want her to think that there's nothing in the world that you're incapable of. The thought of disappointing her is, it's crippling. Why are you suddenly in danger of flunking out? Why do I have to hear about it from Dawson? Why does Dawson know more about your life right now than I do, Pacey? Well, because apparently Leary Sr. has a very big mouth. And oh, how I bet Junior loved being on the receiving oh, end of that. Know, can news. we just stick to the point, please? No, honestly, I'm sure he loved hearing that, you know? Now he's salivating. The guy gets to swoop in on his soulmate with a big fat I told you so. Are you delusional? Dawson has zero to do with this, Pacey. Uh, yeah, sure. Do you have any idea how insulting it is to know that I come up last on your list of people to contact in case of an emergency? Joe, this is not that big a deal, you know? I'm handling it. And how does cutting school translate into handling it, Pacey? Why does this even surprise me? What exactly is that supposed to mean? Exactly what I said. <laughs> this is how you deal with everything. You run away. You take the easy way out every time. Well, I guess that's why I'm such a loser. You know, you're not a loser, Pacey. I didn't spend my summer with a loser. You know, building what I thought was an incredible foundation for a relationship. I thought that we were a great team. It turns out, I guess I couldn't have been more wrong. 